It's the best revenge you've ever gotten. My family was looking for a large house and found the perfect one back in the early 2000s. When my dad talked with the owners they had agreed to getting some plumbing fixed on the house before we moved in if we moved all of their stuff into the two-car garage so it'd be easier for them to move. There were also several things to be repaired, a pool to clean and a ton of landscaping to be done. My dad did the repairs and used his army of offspring to do all the landscaping and pool work. The house was looking amazing compared to before and we were a week from moving in. Now, to this day I do not know why my dad did this, but he had paid a cash deposit. There was no paper trail and the owners decided to take advantage of this. When it got to be a few days before we moved in, the owners told my dad they weren't moving their stuff out of the garage or doing the plumbing fixes that were needed to use any of the bathtubs or showers in the house. He could deal with no garage and pay for the plumbing fixes or he could F off. No refund of deposit if he didn't like it. They even said they were thinking of moving someone else in because the house value was more with all the fixes we had already done. My father asked to turn in the keys we had been given the next morning because this was all told to him at 8 at night on a weekday. With no paperwork yet signed, there was nothing attaching my dad to the house and no cameras or security system. He had just been effed over for a few thousand dollars by the owner and it was maybe two weeks to Christmas. His gift that year was going to be giving each of us kids our own rooms for the first time. Cue our revenge. He brought all of us kids over to the house for a little party. Each kid was given their own special bit of destruction. Someone was shoveling sand into the pool, my brother with anger issues was told to punch out every hole we had patched up in the walls, the smaller kids were told to rock the banister on the stairs until it broke, and I was told to rip out the landscaping we had done out and make a path of it all over the stairs. Every single thing we had fixed or improved was taken back by very creative and energetic children. While all this happened my dad and stepmom went through everything in the garage from the owners and took anything they could give to family, pawn, or sell. There were high-value collectibles, jewelry, and a computer that my dad gave to us for Christmas. The next day my dad told the owners he had put the keys in the garage with its door open that night for them. He then unplugged the phone and we never heard from those people again. Was it legal? No, not on either end. Did we have a good Christmas? Yes. Was it fun destroying the place? Yes.